So when we first started, we were probably selling about, um, uh, you know, maybe maybe 200 donuts in a day. You went from maybe 150 a week to about 3,000 a week. Yeah. Over two years. Yeah. Right? How long have you been making whole wheat donuts? Five months ago, um, I had a vice president of a company come in and for for fun, he's a vice president of a milling company, and for fun I decided to make him some whole wheat donuts uh, just just because he was visiting. And um, he really loved them. Like he was blown away at how good they turned out. Uh, so, you know, that one thing leading to another got us to start saying, okay, well let's start flavor profiling whole wheat donuts and see, see what kind of uh, things we can come up with. From that, uh, being approached by another large company um, saying, well, you know, um, can we perfect the whole wheat donut and sell them on a, on a more scalable project? So we're, we're starting by oh, here being open six days a week and getting customer feedback. So how would a, one of your whole wheat low fat donuts compare to a commercial, like a Tim Hortons donut? So we have about three and a half to four grams of fat in a whole wheat donut. So it's, you know, so now the person Versus who... how much in a, in a conventional one? I've never seen a yeast product yet that comes under um, 12 grams of fat. So if they're lower in fat, are they also lower in calories? Yeah, they are actually. Roughly about 170 calories, um, never, always under 200. So well, uh, about uh, 320 on a regular donut. And what about this International Donut Day? Have you done this before? Never, never done International Donut Day before. You know, HFT thinks that, you know, when it really comes down to it, um, they're just silly donuts, right? They're supposed to have fun. We're supposed to have fun with them. And uh, what we're going to do is uh, anybody that comes in, uh, you can have a free donut. Just ask for a donut and you get one.